Hi everyone and welcome back to today's morning report with me Richard Payne Market Analyst at Home Tech Markets for Thursday the 12th of June. I'm going to move on to Euro dollar now and despite the fact that uh, sterling continues to appreciate, Euro is under pressure still. There's no real sign of any any significant recovery going on. I mean, over, overnight we haven't yet broken below yesterday's low, which I suppose is a, is a potential bonus. Uh, but 35.20 remains intact. That was yesterday's low. But it's not really um, done anything today. Uh, and you'd say that um, looking at uh, looking at the intraday chart, it's not really been able to build any sort of recovery, uh, whilst um, certainly sterling has done. Um, 35, as I said, 3520 was yesterday's low. It's yet to breach that, but it certainly doesn't necessarily mean that's not going to happen. Um, you've got a, a reaction high at 3557, but uh, you, you'd certainly be saying that the key resistance is now at 3585, which was that former support here um, from this uh, trading band. Um, and I think uh, any sort of recovery you get, I mean, be it maybe towards that 35. 57 mark is probably uh, a chance to sell uh, today. And when you've got all these momentum indicators on the intraday chart, negative configuration just really unwinding that oversold position. Um, even on the even on the daily chart, is still um, is still under a lot of pressure. These momentum indicators are very bearish, uh, and just just any sort of chance that you would get uh, to sell is probably an opportunity. Um, I think ultimately. As we've said previously, Euro is coming back towards a test of this 3475 February low. Um, but at the moment, you're, you're not really getting any real jump to the upside in, in order to get, get that as a selling opportunity. But uh, as and when it happens, maybe give it a go. But certainly, I think at the moment, it remains under pressure. It's uh, The Euro is, is trading down against the dollar today. And uh, to be honest, not much is. Um, uh, certainly, um, sterling is up, uh, Kiwi dollar up, Aussie dollar up, uh, but Euro is not. So, um, any sort of jump you do get in this uh, Euro chart today, I think, is a chance to sell. Uh, you've got the uh, US retail sales today. That um, could certainly have an impact on this chart. Uh, if the retail sales come in stronger, then that would be a negative for Euro dollar. Euro dollar lower, so uh, just be careful of that at 130 or so. The weekly jobless claims number, uh, as well, an improved um, uh, improved number for the weekly jobless claim would again be a drag on the euro dollar. Okay, well, I wish you good luck in your trading today, and I will speak to you later. Thank you.